Hi, I'm Kurt Travis. And I'm Zach Garen. Zachary Garen. And uh, we're going to talk about some tour pranks. I heard this tour prank once. It was on Warp Tour. And uh, I'm not going to name any bands or anything, but uh, they had a keyboardist. And he, it was one of those keyboards that were all set to samples, like different samples, different sounds. And uh, they taped the whole keyboard, uh, all the all the keys so that when he pressed one of them they would all go off at the same time I thought that was like really really brilliant because yeah if it's not like just set even if it was just notes that would sound so horrible <laughs> and I guess the guy was so pissed off and he started crying and he was like just super super uh, bummed out and those two bands like never toured ever again. Um, this isn't one that's, that's been done, it's just one that I'd like to do but probably won't do because it would be kind of mean. But um, the band we're touring with right now, um, they have a few instances in their set um, that are also like the, the names of, of other songs, like pop songs, um, coincidentally. And I, I feel like it would be really fun if uh, so they have, they have one song that's called Lose Yourself. I think it would be tight if instead of them playing If Lose Yourself by Eminem, just played over the PA right before they started playing. You better lose yourself in the <laughs> And then uh, they have another song where the singer says uh, the words Blurred Lines. I feel like it would be tight if their sound just cut off and Blurred Lines started playing. <laughs> and um, they also talk a lot about love and I feel like it would be tight if um, every time they did, that uh, what is love song <laughs> what came is on. <laughs> but their set's really serious, so it'd be really mean. I'd never do it. Just in my head. <laughs>